welcome back to Green Hell Clear Cut. We're at our lovely little oasis. We get a little bit of a camp going here and we are doing okay. Everything's good. Um, I just, I need to deal with our needs. Uh, so, it's primarily water and carbs and a little bit of fat. And so, do I have meat on me? Yeah, I still have meat on me. So, uh, but that doesn't have fat. Let's peccary meat. Yeah, we can we can take care of all of our protein meat. I've got a day and a half on that and a day and a half on this. All right. I think I'll just save the rattlesnake meat for, like, energy later on. And we'll just eat this. And that's good. And we're going to eat that. That was also very good. And we're going to um, eat this honeycomb. And, oh, good. That was great. We're going to drink some water. Or I need more water. But I need coconuts, too. So I can actually... Like, this rock, they spawn... These big rocks spawn in this area so often. Like, I don't have... Like, what am I going to do with all these stones? I don't know. Nothing, really. I'm going to move them out of the way so I don't stumble over them. Because, you know, stubbing your toe out here could be fatal. It really could be. Because, you know, infections and stuff... And so let's not do that. But there's bananas here, and I'm going to eat one of those. And we'll maybe just leave another one on the tree. Do I need carbs? Uh, you know, I could eat one more. Let's eat it. And is there more left there? There's apparently one more or two more. There's two more on there. That's good. But we need water more than anything. And look, more bananas over here. That's, uh, you know, I'm going to take one with me, two, two with me. And we're going to go over here and see about some stuff. We need sticks for the fire. Oh, we need to feed the fire, too. Can't forget about that. And, yeah, so we cut down so much stuff yesterday that there's, yeah, lots of sticks laying around here. That's not going to be a problem for us. Uh, see? See? No problem at all. We're, in fact, full already. But look. Oh, God, I almost walked off the edge. i got to kind of pay more attention to what the hell I'm doing. Okay. Um, right. Uh, coconuts. We need to go find a coconut so we can do more water. But I think I'm going to go ahead and put some of these logs in place over here. Just because they were there and we're here. And while, while we're... Look at that bird sitting there. Um, Alright, can I... Can I get the green on it? Okay, that's weird. That, and we're going to get a little bit more water out of this. Like so. And... Yeah, all this water. It looks so clean and refreshing. But there's fish poop all over in there and those fish have parasites or something so we're not going to drink that water without boiling it first because we've learned our lesson in the past by doing dumb things like that and it just makes you sick and then and then you die all right we're going to try these palms over here because they're the only freaking palm trees really close and but i don't see any coconuts and there's, I don't see any up top either. Crap. Okay. Well, off we go to find. Oh, look, there's a one of those mushrooms. With, does this have anything? You know, it's not even a, it's not a fruit tree. All right, but we're gonna look around here. And oh, this is leopard territory. Oh, and this plant. This plant has to go. All right, and this one too. We're gonna clear all these freaking plants out of here. Cause, and this one definitely has to go. That's a prime spot for a snake to hide. I'm going to destroy that and yeah, with so many plants to clear out here. But I, don't, I really don't want to spend all freaking day just chopping at plants, but I can't help myself. I hate them. We're gonna, they got to go. And I know hate is a destructive emotion, guys. Don't, don't have that, but I've been out here long enough with these plants and we... I mean, it's it. That's it. We... We've come to an agreement. They don't like me. I don't like them. And I have the axe. So I win. This plant. All right. Okay. So we're going to yeah, clear out a nice pathway. So, Because this is an area that I want to go up and down through here quite often uh, because of this plant. Not, no, that's not why I want to come up here. Uh, there's capybara down here. 
and the potential for coconuts and stuff. And look, see, there's a armadillo over there. And I'm going to kill that guy too. We're going to eat him. And but these plants have to go first. We've just got to make a nice clear. Yeah, this. Get out of there. It's hiding. I thought it might get away from me, but nope. And then this one. So I think this will this will be a nice clean swath that we can walk without fear of snakes so much. Yeah. And I don't like that palm tree either, but I want to deal with the palm leaves because we have... Oh, let's destroy that one. Uh, and this plant has to go too. All right, but I really want a coconut shell for, and this plant has to go. I want that the coconut shells so we can boil water properly. And, man, if I had the pot with me, but I don't even remember where I left that thing. Oh, but these, these are good. You know, I could, I could do this. Watch. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna do something stupid, um, which shouldn't surprise anybody really. Um, look, see, I've got all this unsafe water. Watch, I'm gonna drink all of that unsafe water. Hey. Oh. Okay, I it it upset me, but it didn't hurt me. Well, that's great. That's great. We got I got off. I got off pretty easily on that one. Um, the reason why I did that, guys, is because I picked up all these mushrooms. These unknown mushrooms will cure parasites. So if we ended up getting parasites from uh, this guy. Come here, come here, come here. You have to stop. Yeah, if I ended up getting parasites, we could cure them immediately with those orange mushrooms. So that's that's why we did that. But See, so we solved a little bit of our hard hydration problem, and and we didn't get sick, even though it it made my my guy go. <laughs> he didn't he didn't like the flavor of the fish poop. But hey, you know beggars can't be choosers. You're living in the freaking rainforest. Okay. Now, over there, I'm sure there's capybaras. I'm sure of it, which would be a good place for a trap, but. I'm not gonna pull them there right now. Maybe, maybe we'll set one, like set the frame for it, and we just do it at, at our leisure. But for now, I'm not concerned so much because I have meat, and like I'm gonna eat one of that rattlesnake meat right now, and uh, and maybe a banana. We'll eat one too. Yeah, see, we keep ourselves nice. Oh, get yes, plant. You gotta watch out for snakes in this area too. And yeah, as we go through here, okay, up on the on the hill, I think there might be um, coconuts potentially. Oh, see, and up in this area, there's palm trees up there. That's coconut territory, but these plants have to go. And I don't care about those maggots. Uh, here, let's kill that plant, and there's a lovely vagina tree right there, and we're gonna keep going up here and see where, ah, coconut, oh my god, well, I'm stuck, you'd think I can squeeze through that gap, but I couldn't, all right, let's destroy that, and we're gonna cut down this, and we're gonna pick up that, see, I can't pick that up, all right, but we're gonna, we're gonna make room for it, because I like, I like having plenty of that stuff, let's destroy this, and this, and this, and I'm still not going to have room for the tobacco leaf, am I? Nope. Crap. All right, but we're going to get this coconut for sure. Uh, all right, what are we going to do about that? Uh, okay, I got eight leaf bandages. Let's craft them along with this, because I honestly, having having snake bite kits are are very, very important in a survival situation. Let's craft this along with this. We'll find more Molinadia, I'm sure. But then I can take a couple of those bandages and drop them. I don't need to have all these bandages. Like six snake bite kits is a little bit overkill, I think. Here. And Alright, where's more palm trees? Over that direction. Let's see if we can find more coconuts, maybe. Uh, 
Uh, nope. It's a rock. And this plant has to go. But we we should see capybara around here. So this plant. And my axe is not long for this world. Okay, there's a an ant hill. So I'm gonna clear some of these plants around here. So we don't get too close to that thing. You don't like it. Nuts, maybe? You got nuts under here? No. Plant! There we go. Doesn't this look so much better without the underbrush to conceal things? Snakes and spiders are no longer as big a threat when you've cleared out all this underbrush like this. And I like it. So we're going to do that. So, so much better. And if you need to find big stones, look, they're much easier to see when they're not concealed by a freaking tree or a big bushy plant thing. All right, but uh, we don't really need to go in that direction. I don't see any more coconut palms. So back we, uh, this, see, I'd like to get rid of this guy, but it's a palm tree and they, I don't, they bother me. They're just too, it's too much to clear after you cut it down. These, these are one thing. You know, but the the palm trees with the fronds that go everywhere, forget it. They're a pain in the butt. Yeah, the axe is just about done here. All right, can I get that and destroy it? Yes. All right, well, we're doing good on keeping the place clean after we do this clearing. So that's good, right? But in this area right over here... I, I'm surprised I haven't run into a capybara already. Or maybe I have and they've just seen me first and they ran away. But there's frogs. And, okay, this plant has to go. Alright, but you know what? We're going to take care of some things. I'm going to destroy this. to keep our energy high by eating that rattlesnake meat and we're going to drink this and we're going to harvest it and eat and eat there we go now we've got our coconut bowls we needed for boiling water I'm really surprised I didn't get parasites from the Shit. that that uh, yes seriously yes seriously uh, dude we've already had this conversation we knew that was gonna break what's the problem here okay see I talked to myself but you know it's useless because I just don't listen We need to get rope. What am I thinking about? We got no freaking rope. Alright. Well, we found one coconut. That's a milestone. That's a big uh, The plant has uh, to go. Uh, and I'm getting so good at making axes now. It's my life. I'm the axe crafter. And if you don't like it, you can kiss my axe. Haha. <laughs> Let's see what I did there. All right, we're, that was kind of rude, guys. I, I do apologize. I've been too long alone. My social skills have waned. But this plant has to go. It's just me and the plants. And I, I'm so bitter about these plants. Okay, forget that one. I don't even care about that. Oh, see, but here, I told you we'd find Molinadia, and it, we have. It's right there. And so I'm going to make a few bandages. Just to replace the ones that I keep turning into the uh, tobacco leaf. And I, I don't really need the bandages. It's just habit now to always have more bandages than I could ever use. And, but I haven't seen bad guys for quite a while. And that's kind of surprising too. But these plants, we're going to get them all taken care of eventually. Look at all these plants that they just have to all die. 
But we're gonna, I'm working my way over to this tree to get some rope. It's, uh, there is a purpose. It's not always just aimlessly milling about, guys. Just so you know, I'm not just on a plant genocide spree for the sake of killing the plant. Okay, this plant's got to go. Now, it's not purely to satisfy my uh, chlorophyll lust or whatever. I mean, they don't have blood, right? So, no, I did have a purpose. I wanted to get this. And this plant. So, we're working our way back now. All right, I'm just getting rope along the way. And, and clearing these plants, of course. Because that's what we have to do. It's my mission in life. But, you know, if you look around... Okay, let's get these plants out of the way. And then we'll look around. If, if you look around, like... Oh my god, there's still too many plants. It's okay, never mind the look around thing. Because... I was going to say, if you look around without all the plants, it's so much easier to see stuff, but there's still there's freaking plants everywhere. We gotta, they have to go, these guys. But eventually, we're going to notice a big, big difference. Like uh, this area. Let's see how different it looks without all the freaking plants everywhere. It's so much better. All right, well, this, this has to go. We're doing good work on keeping it clean, too. Okay, come on. There we go. All right, but we're already losing our daylight. I haven't... I feel like I haven't really done anything. But we did find a coconut. That's something. And we've killed so many plants. See, I mean, we cleared uh, one swath on the way down and another swath on the way back up. And now it's like this whole big area is being completely cleared of these horrible, horrible plants. All right, I, I feel fairly well satisfied that we've cleared enough plants for now. We're going to take a couple bananas with us. We've got our coconut. We're going to go do some water, and I think I'm going to... Okay, I'm going to kill this plant. Yeah, we and we've got to feed our fire. If it's not out by now, it probably is, but... All right, destroy that. And look at all these palm leaves. I'm going to destroy well, a couple of them. More than that. Just All right, I'm done with those. We're losing our daylight already. It seems like it just gets too dark too fast. But let's get this. Just cut this down. And this one. We're going to cut this one down. i got to take two logs down for sure. Where, where are they going? Okay, where's the other log? Crap. Alright, rope though. We'll get that rope. And we'll get that log. Okay, where's the other log at? Right, long sticks everywhere. We're going to need those. But I need the second log piece and who knows where it bounced off to what the hell but that uh, man you know what here this is I these plants there's that log see it was hiding under this plant the plant was concealing it the log was innocent in the whole thing guys it was all the plant but there we've got our second log and we're off off to the races we're gonna put this stuff in place like we've been planning on, and there we go. And yes, indeed, the fire is out, and that's okay. We can use the charcoal. And now we got this. We're going to drink that. We will light another fire here momentarily. Let's go ahead and clear out the ash and charcoal. And go ahead and set it up. There, because we got so much, so many sticks up top. But we'll light that in a moment. I've got plenty of energy right now, so we're good. But yeah, see, there's stuff everywhere, and I want to get these long sticks in place and see if we can find a little bit more rope. Because that, and this plant, 
and there's a dry leaf. We'll just grab that for the moment. And sticks and stick. See, get all these sticks. And then, yeah, we'll need these long sticks, obviously. There's two. There's three more. And I know I've got three more laying around here. Uh, and one more somewhere. Come on. Where is it? There it is. All right, good. And there's even another one there, and another one there. All right. Not sure I'm going to be using those. Maybe. Who knows? I want to have this place set up, though. Get this roof in place, or at least the scaffolding part of it. And ropes. Oh, come on. See, I'm bumping, I'm bumping my head on it, and it's probably not great because. The, and look, there's a stone on my bed. Get off of there. It doesn't belong there. Put it with all these other stones. They can make little stones. I'll we'll drink that. Alright, let's go ahead and light the fire up. Wow. So, today has been very uneventful, I think. You know, in the scheme of things. But we did acquire a lot of stuff, and we got rid of so many plants. I'm like the local oh, herbicide. Yes. yes, dude, I know. Fire is good. All right, now, using our lovely new coconut shells, we can get water. Okay, we're here. Where's the thing? This, and is there a water? Yeah, see, I can get water right out of the middle of the fire, which is bizarre, but it works. Here we go. So we'll cook that up. We'll get some mushroom soup going. Let's eat a banana. We're going to cook the armadillo meat and mushroom. And that's pretty good, right? We got things going. I hope you guys have enjoyed this. If you have, please smash the like button. Leave me any comments. Jump up and down a little bit. Uh... Tips, tricks, recommendations, or death threats. We've got our lovely bed here. We're going we're gonna to sleep. I think I'm going to throw a roof on it because, look, we've got palm leaves laying everywhere. We can we can use those. because And maybe we'll, I'll justify chopping down another one of those freaking palm trees because now we'll need the leaf for something, you know? And we can put a lid on this other one, too. All right, I was doing an outro. Uh, again, thank you. For, you know, and if you want to leave comments and stuff... And subscribe, share, favorite at your at your leisure and pleasure. And we will talk with all of you again very, very soon. Yay. I like her.